Hey guys, thanks for joining me today in the shop. My name is Robert. I own a transmission shop in Georgia. Uh, what we're going to do is a series of videos on how to basically rebuild a transmission. The first one we're going to do is a 47 RH transmission out of a 95 Dodge Ram 2500. The uh, reason we selected this one is because it's usually severely abused. You'll see a lot of detail on how it's done, why it's done, and what it's going to take to actually do this type of repair and the money that it takes to do this type of repair. Therefore, when someone gives you a price on why it's, you know, the price of, and the expense, you're not totally surprised at why it costs that. Uh, also, it is if you ever decide to do it yourself, there's a lot of how-to that you'll be able to pick up to do it yourself if that's what you'd like to try. If you're a DIYer, this would be great for you. Uh, we're going to start with a video of pulling the transmission. It's, uh, it's not super detailed, but you should be able to get enough of what it takes to get the transmission out that if you want to try it yourself, you should be able to. Then we'll bring the transmission in, tear it apart, come up with exactly what's wrong with the transmission, come up with a parts list of what we need to replace, what should be replaced, and why it's being replaced. Then we'll do a video segment on cleaning the parts. Well, that, that's really the most important issue is getting the parts clean and inspected thoroughly. Then we'll do a sub-assembly section where we're rebuilding each sub-assembly clutch pack, uh, each drum, that type of deal. We'll put the transmission sub-assemblies together. Then we'll probably do a video on a shift kit. The transmission we're doing is severely abused. The guy that owns it actually works here and he, uh, he pulls the world with it. He, he's always abusing this vehicle so this one's going to have a lot of wear. Then we'll do a, a segment on building the actual transmission, putting all the sub-assemblies in, what it takes, what you need to know, which, you know, kind of how to put it together yourself if that's what you would like to do. Then we'll do a segment on putting the transmission in, flushing the cooler, that type of stuff, and a test drive, and just to see what the updates that we've done, how it performs, and, well, we just want to make sure that it's going to perform to his standards. You know, if, if you like what you're seeing now, subscribe. There will be a lot more coming. Thank you.